So if you're not learning, fuck that. I'll say by 21. And my age dwindle. I say 22, 21. I'll make it 21. Fuck it. Because you've been learning. You've been learning. And you're capable of getting a job by the time you're what? 17, 18? I had one. So Well, it depends, you know, on um, I mean like stacking your money. How much or, are you pursuing a job? And see, that's the thing. Because you have some kids who grew up pampered. You feel me? And they don't want to work because they mom and dad, they do everything for them. But then you have other kids that that just got to go get it by any means. Yeah. Having so, the hustle in you is, is got to be in you. Yeah. It, it, you know, so it's like when you're living in a world like that, it's got to be in That's you. where you got to learn people mindset at um, because we grow up different. You know? Everybody has to grow and the world make money. So, you know, just like when I was a kid, I just really damn. always had a little Damn, hustle. when you was a kid. Well, I could make some money. <laughs> shit, I, that was I, a I, long I, ass I, time ago. I could mow grass. I was doing Fuck shit. Fuck, it was black and white outside. I was outside doing shit the Mexicans was doing as a kid. <laughs> Fuck the TV. I was black doing and white. shit the Mexicans doing as a kid. <laughs> You know, cutting grass, cutting bushes and shit like that. Cause was the TVs had, black and white when you was a kid? Yeah, too. I used to watch black and white. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I can't laugh. I can't laugh. You can't laugh. That's black and white for you, no. too. <laughs> yeah, they no. watch black and white. Too. No, we show the old school some love, Joe. You know, we didn't, we, didn't, that. we didn't really <laughs> care about that. As long as we could watch that motherfucker TV. Man, y'all old ass niggas, man. Look, look, man. But then when the color did kick in, it kicked in. Look, all I'm saying is 21, 22, that's a nice. You got to give them. That's a nice number. 22, because nice 21, you're officially grown, not 18. For who? 18 means you just graduated from high school. Oh. Yeah. Not 19, 20. But it's high schoolers with jobs. Exactly. I mean, you it's know, sophomores, juniors, and seniors with jobs. It depends. It depends on. It depends. You know, if it's in you, it's in you. If it's not, it's if not. If it's not, yeah, if you ain't got exactly. nobody yeah. around to show okay. you or push you, yeah, then it won't be in you. It's, it's gonna be well. Uh, you make it happen. You just have to learn, and you see others progressing, and you just broke sitting around them, ain't nothing. You stuck in and living with your mom. Yeah. Talk your shit, yeah, Tim. Mom, what Tim, give you the oh, claps. Give oh, you the sis. I'm you. talking about. Talk your shit, man. Oh, Teach him. Hey, 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 Tim, dog. Hey. hey, and learning trades is black because I learned a lot of trades in my life. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I learned how to do a lot of different things. Photography, all kind of things. Just different things. Never, that's why you go to school and learn different. Like, you always went to school to learn different uh, classes. Jack of all trades. You had to pick a class. You, know, you had to pick art. Uh, you had to pick science, wood shop. You know, I, I, I was fortunate to go to places where we had wood shop, leather shop, Titan, mm -hmm. all that shit in grammar school. And then the Republicans cut it out the next year, and we ain't had that shit no more. So, because I know we was programmed to work for them instead of be our own boss. Hey. Yeah. And that's what I don't like. It's all about changing the narrative. It's all about changing the narrative. Always changing the narrative. Coming together, doing what's right, what's correct. Yeah. Everything don't always start off right, but we can always change it and change the narrative for the greater good. Um, closing remarks. Closing remarks. We at Joe's too. Friday, come rock out. Man. Joe's. What up, man? man. You gotta, you what know up, what man? You gotta hit the chills or something. Come on, man. Yeah. God damn, man. This is crazy. <laughs> man. It was crazy. Hey, we at Joe's. Friday, let's go, man. Turn up. Hey, closing remarks. You got any closing remarks tonight before we get up out of here? What's up, man? I know you got something to get a people with jam and a jewel. You know? Uh, okay. Um, love your people, man. Always love your people. 
make sure you keep your family close, but you know, there's a lot going on out here. Nobody's promised tomorrow. And just make sure you keep your people close to you, you know what I'm saying? For and, sure. And, and learn to get along, drop all the bullshit from the past and just move forward. You know, somebody have to squash the beef at some point and you know, just keep it real, you know what I'm saying? Our people we gotta stick together. That's what's up. That's what's up.